So today we have an iPhone 8 um, for no power issue repair. So the first thing uh, we need to do is plug in the charging port and see what the reading is on the um, power supply. So again, we are getting 0 0.2 amp which is nothing so it looks like it looks like the phone is not getting power so next thing we need to do is take some measurements and um see so um check out the check out the lcd screen So let's put our um, voltmeter on dial mode uh, reading. So um, let's see. And let's take some measurements. Let's find out what's going on. See if we can get any, see any short or anything. So let's check the power connector. 0.44 volt which is fine. It's ground right here. Um, that's fine. Let, let's go to the microscope. Uh, this is much clearer. Let's go to microscope. Let's start zooming. Okay. So that's our battery connector. So we have positive on ground and ground on the test. So better connection. So we get 0.75 volt. That's fine. Uh, 0.7 volt. That's fine as well. Um, let's check to see if it's short. Uh, let's go to uh, ZXW. And, um, Six up for you. So ZX up for you. Okay, ZX up for you. So if you look at ZX up for you, let me see. iPhone. Let's look for iPhone. iPhone eight. So calm, so it's calm. That's fine. Yeah, let's match. So this probably, I believe this is, nope, nope. Okay, V, uh, V, V, D, V, D, D main, which is the main power supply for the whole phone. Um, so what is it, what is it, the third, the third one? So, one, two, three. Oh, look like this is short. So this is short on VVD main. Okay. So, uh, let's check where that short is at. Let's go back to microscope. So we know that this is short on VVD main. So we're just going to inject a low voltage, like one point volt, um, which is pretty low for VD main, and see if we can find out short. Let me just make sure it's one volt. Okay, let's inject one volt to VVD main.
Mm, the point of vote is kind of low, so let's up. Okay. So it looks like we have a, from our injection, we can tell the beep by the beeps. So that's, um, it looks like um, some chip is short. Because the cap is short, it will probably burn out that cap already. But since it's kept on beep, it's, you know, it kept on beeping, then this is short. Um, so within the uh, some IC circuit. So uh, so next thing is to take out the, the bo whole board and and um, try to find um, what circuit is that, uh, what chi chip is that. So. So we took we took out the uh, the board and it's like we can tell what is burning when we inject in the voltage. Ch this chip right here. Um, this is a uh, baseband power IC. Oh my goodness. So um, it looks like if you can tell there, it looks like it was you know uh, it's the Intel baseband IC chip. Uh, from our experience, we can tell with the kind of O right here. See, look, it burnt. So. Let's hope it's just the chip, not the um, baseband CPU. Okay, let's take out this chip. To see if we can boot up. Uh, this one, um, we don't see um, this one go out too often, but it does go out, but it doesn't burn like this. It just die. But this one, it just burned. So let's take it out, make sure, you know. So, you know, when you're repairing no power IC, no power phone and it's short, it's best to do visual inspection. It helps a lot, you know, to determine, you know, uh, what is getting short. So on this case, you know, we inject the voltage and the, and, uh, the beeps keep on going. It means that usually it's like a, an IC you know that is short so as you can see this one burned out so let's try to take it out let's try not put a heat on the um, power IC right here so let's keep the heat on it just this one Now let's check for the, um, see we still have a short. So our short is gone. Um, this is a VVD main that we found earlier right here. So the short is gone, so that's good. And let's just hope that, you know, we don't have the baseband issue, so. Let's put on down mode reading, reading so. So to make sure it's not short. Okay, we're getting 0 0.236. It's mm, kind of low, but. Um, but it's not, the consensus of the board is hot, so that's why. So, so the, board, the board is not short anymore, so. Um, Let's clean this up, and so at, at any rate, um, we don't have that chip available. So um, let's test to see uh, first to see if uh, the p no power sh issue is fixed.
Okay, let's put the board um, back and test to see if uh, it boosts up. Let's see if we can charge it. Okay, looks like, okay. Looks like we resolved the um, no power issue. Um, there you go. Okay, it looks like the um, no power issue is fixed. Oh, it's not focused. Well, that's it, guys, uh, for now. Um, thank you for watching the, vid the video. Uh, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, please subscribe and hit the like button as well. It helps us a lot.